Welcome to the Sweet Frog Mobile Marketing Update. I'm Mike Agadio. Today is June 1st, and here are the highlights. So, we finally have, based on all the text offers we've ever done for Sweet Frog, what is the average rate of return per offer? This is a little surprising. The 10% offer is 8% effective. You can expect an 8% return on that, where the 20% is only 6% return. The buy one get one 50% seems to be pretty effective with a 14% average rate of return. The most least effective offer you can do in a text message is the BOGO buy one get one free which is 50% off and of course the buy one get one at 50% off is really just 25% off at 14% and the most effective offer you can do is the $4 all you can fit in a 12 ounce cup. So what are the pros and cons of the $4 cup? I'm hearing lots of things like people can pile it three feet high and you lose money, but I'm not so sure that's the case, so help me help you figure out what the real cost of the $4 12-ounce cup. I go ahead and test market with 10 customers as they come through the door, offer the deal to them of $4, all they can fit in a 12-ounce cup, and give me the average weight of all 10 together, and we can finally put this one to rest if uh, four or five stores uh, participate. Um, guessing and hearing from other store owners that it's really only a 15 percent discount and if that is true we have found a really good silver bullet what has that done to our average numbers uh, we still get about at 149 average redemptions per text blast per store um, the average list is 1845 average subscribers per list 27 opt-outs per text that's point zero one four opt-out rate that's very good that means our customers are happy with our text offers and they don't unsubscribe overall among all stores among all text blasts we average an eight percent return so if your list is a thousand or per each thousand that you have on your your text subscriber list you can expect eighty redemptions that's eighty customers walking through the door showing the text offer the average transaction with per text blast is eight dollars and ninety one cents that's slightly higher than the six dollars per transaction among all sweet frog stores so that's pretty good and the average revenue generated per text is around seventeen hundred dollars um, again that's averaging all stores and all blasts that we've ever sent so chattanooga had a great month uh... over memorial day they had two hundred and sixty four redemptions that was an eight point seven six return on their list of three thousand that they've building building up for the last couple months and they just did a simple ten percent offer gastonia had three hundred and thirty five redemptions which was a six point nine two percent rate on their list of four thousand eight hundred and forty four and they offered for just one day only memorial day twenty percent off and a free cup for vets so when you think about that just being for one day that is a pretty good redemption rate morgantown killed it over memorial day weekend with the four dollar cup they had five hundred and twenty six redemptions that was a whopping twenty nine percent return rate on their list of seventeen hundred that they've built up um, actually they've only been open for about a month and a half so good job morgantown they also did the Facebook check-ins, as many of you did. Uh, they saw 9,289 claimed, um, but uh, don't take a big gasp yet. Only 144 came in and actually used the offer of these 9,000, but still some big numbers. And I think they increased their likes by 400 or 500 just by doing this offer. Who's leading the way on total subscribers? Gastonia is still in the lead. Concord right behind. Greensboro and Morgantown nipping closely and Hicks and Chattanooga growing their list pretty fast and Hanover Rock Hill and Roanoke and Clarksville getting into the mix very quickly in fact Hanover's probably they haven't even been open three or four weeks now so that's 30 days of damage they're doing really well how to read the leaderboard so I've given you that special link where you can see all the text offers that anybody's doing and what the redemption rate let's just follow this real quick for Gastonia they did 24% off and they did free for vets. I actually put the 26 in here. That's how many vets actually claimed the free cup. Um, they had 331 redemptions on Memorial Day. They had four Facebook check-ins from the offer. Um, they had about 232 claimed. The text blast was sent on Monday at 10 o'clock and it was sent to 4,844 people and they had 29 unsubscribes. 
that gave them their 6.92 percent return if you click on this you can see my math up here just divided the redemptions by how many messages were sent they also reported to me how much they discounted remember it was a little bit heavier than usual with 26 vets getting a free cup so this was slightly lower than our nine dollar rate um, and it generated two thousand three hundred ninety eight dollars gross revenue for Gastonia and if you click over here you can see the complete message that we sent also owners have been asking for a quick start guide for employees you can find this at how now mobile sweet frog if you're familiar with this page go down and click download quick start guide for employees and this will give you a quick two-pager PDF you can print off and hand to employees that will tell them all about the texting program you can see all the sweet frog updates I've ever sent by going to how now mobile sweet frog update and every email I've ever sent including how to do Facebook offer videos and charts and graphs are all there under sweet frog update as well as this video let's talk about table tents I've been going around visiting quite a few stores and what I see is a lack of table tents on tables um, I'm hearing all kinds of things like uh, they fall they break uh, the employees don't put them up I've actually had a few owners tell me they know when the table tents aren't out because they don't see any winners um, so what does that cost you if one table tent is not out and you have a total of 10 tables you're losing three thousand dollars almost four thousand dollars a year for that one table tent not being out so I have a solution for those that need a solution behold the table sticker it sticks it removes uh, nicely it is resistant to bleach and cleaning supplies and tables being turned upside down and this is the way to make sure your table tent stay on the table and the call to action is there um, recommend putting it in the middle but you can put it anywhere on the table and there are five dollars per sticker so let me know how many you need you probably should order a few more um, so if you have ten tables go ahead and order twenty they're five dollars per sticker also want to keep you up to date with uh, what other stores are doing creative uses of the text campaigns uh, Catonsville is actually putting this on a mailer that's going to thousands of households it's a text to activate coupon Sweet Frog Columbus is also doing this with flyers and coupons so if you need an extra keyword or an extra frog seven in this case for Catonsville they're doing a buy one get one free uh, through print and direct mail um, make sure you let us know we can create that for you also for churches schools any way you want to list segment your list um, we can do it for you so just get in touch with me and we'll take care of it so you guys all have heard the yogurt stores reach 1.6 billion last year with the demand expected to jump even more this year last fall there was about 4,765 stores up 31 percent from last year chances are they're probably building a store near you um, how you can help me help you is tell your Sweet Frog friends and Sweet Frog Corporate about what a good job we're doing so we can keep doing a good job for you. Appreciate that. So what are we going to do for June? Um, based on the offer chart that in the beginning of this video, I think we should do a 10% or buy one, get one 50% off. Um, let's do it for two or three days, either during the week or this next weekend, but we need to make sure we wrap it up before June 10th if we're going to do a Father's Day last on the 17th and I'd recommend doing a four dollar cup there or a 10 percent at a minimum and if you'd like to program the whole month out let's just take care of it all at once that would help me and it would also help you I'm sure you're busy um, let's plan out the month of June so not only does yogurt come from cows but so does great mobile marketing how now brown cow how now brown cow how now brown cow how now brown cow